Hey guys, Jamie and today on Roblox we're playing some more Pokemon Brick Bronze. As you can see on screen right now, today we're teaming up with Russo Talks. Obviously, uh, for the first battle or for this video, I'm going to specifically be using the Durantina and then in the next video, I'm going to be using the Rayquaza just to like try and spread around. So I don't want to use two dragons in the same team, that'd be very unfortunate. But we're up against T Brian and Roblox Guy123. So then. Lead off with the Lugia, and I guess I'll lead off with this. Actually, try set up the set up, set up with this first. Um, does it, is it even worth me setting up that? Probably not. He has a shiny enter. Okay, so you probably have ice. You probably have ice. So I probably will need this, and most likely, should I go with the wishy washy? Um. I guess the Wish Rush. I guess it's an okay team, but also, I'm still getting used to the Durantina, so I'm not that good, good at it. Plus, it is a tanky version, so it's not really gonna do. Oh, it's not gonna have too much output damage, unfortunately, but we can toxic stall things. Same with the Lugia, I guess, actually. Lugia is a pretty quick tank, so Magnezone and the Jirachu. Ooh. Um. Okay, then. So I can just Dragon Tail any of them, but I probably want to Willow Whip some. Actually, I could, um. Um, what you want him to do? Um, two steel types, we can't even toxic stall any of them. Okay, the Drachi and Mech Magnezone are usually going to be special attackers. The Drachi could hit the uh, Lug Lugia hard with the Shadow Ball. Actually, I'm weak to Shadow Ball as well. You probably have Hidden Power Eye, so I probably want to get rid of the Magnezone, to be honest. Try and break the, um, it hasn't got an Air Bloom, so that's interesting. I guess I'll Dragon Tail the Magnezone. Okay, okay. okay, so he's gonna stop out into the Volcrona. Also, that's gonna be really, really good. He's gonna then headbutt me. That's fine. Thunder Wave onto the Volcrona. Now that kind of sucks. Plus, I don't have my, I don't have any Heal Bellows on my team right now, so didn't really think about doing that. Did I get flinched? I think I got flinched. Okay, I got Zen headbutt by a Drachia. Um. So yeah. Okay, let, let me think about this actually really quickly. Um. I'm gonna detail the magnet zone so I can try and get it out of here because it's gonna just paralyze everything. So just try and drag and tail the magnet zone because it it's gonna hit hard. I'm thinking Magnezone might hit harder than the Dracha. Zen headbutt onto the Volcarona. And he got flinched. My gosh. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we'll get that out. He's gonna go into the Hydreigon now, which I'm pretty sure I can tank a hit, so that's a little bit better. I could just Toxic Solid, but I think I just want to Dragon Tail it again. Um, I should be able to live a hit, so if Russo wants to go, uh, you wanna go for Drachia? Because if you can take out the Drachia, then we should potentially be good. So I guess I'll Dragon Tail the Hydreigon, because it's most likely gonna go for me. So I guess I'll try and Dragon Tail this thing, then head back onto the Volcrona. Outrage on some... Oh, the burn! Rip, I thought he would go after me. Surprised he actually didn't go for me, I guess I'll Dragon Tail it out of there and instantly. Just th throw it back out into a Crobat. Okay, so we know all of this guy's Pokemon Crobat, Magnezone, and the, um... Hydreigon. But it says physical attacking hit Hydreigon? That's a... I guess it's okay, but that's definitely unexpected. Kaelin. So he's gonna psychic the Crobat. So I will. Actually, I'm gonna go for the Will O Wisp on the Crobat. Actually, is that a good idea? I guess I'll Dragon Tail the Jirachi. That's gonna just be a, not a nuisance. He's gonna Dark Pulse. That's probably gonna be on to Lugi again. Is it gonna flinch it? Oh, I didn't even think about Z moves. I think I have a couple of Z moves on my team. I think it's on the Alolan Executor and the Wishy Washer. So hey, Wishy Washer is gonna be fun to use. So also, like I said, um, still getting used to the Juntina, although it is really tanky, so that's kind of good. Oh, wait, what was that one? That was the Ice one, I believe. Zen Headbutt is going to be onto me. And I got Flip. This guy has the ins- Oh yeah, Ser Seren Grace, it's like a 20 <laughs> There's freaking flinch chance! <laughs> okay, then. He's probably going to be able to take out the Crobat, so I guess I'll try and go for the Drachu. We might as well deal with the Drachu later, because I have my- I have a fuel of Pokemon I can take up the Drachia fairly easily. He's gonna confuse really Lugia. Um, that's okay, I believe. Ice Beam is gonna hit the Crobat. It's gonna take down the Crobat, that's fine. Ice, Lugia on the, Ice Beam on the Lugia, I guess that's kinda good for Dragon types. 
This hopefully doesn't hit me with it. Okay, I was gonna say, if I go freaking flinched again, I'm gonna dread shell there so we don't have to deal with it. Into the enter. Um, I guess I could just toxic stall it. Pressure. I don't want to rest, because if, if I rest, they could easily set up. So I feel like that's probably a bad idea. Plus, I don't have my Gramble or anything to like heal belt to get rid of the rest, which would have been probably a really good idea to have right now. That's fine. But we'll see, okay? But yeah, the Lugia and the Drentina combo, both are weak to eyes. I'm weak to Dragon, although he has Ice Beam, which is really, really good against Dragons. Uh, I have Dragon Tail, I have like Will O Wisp and Toxic, so I can't hit too many things offensively. It's meant to be a tank, then again, Lugia is meant to be a tank as well, but I think Russo is running as like a. What would you call it? Not exactly a sweeper, more like a wall breaker sort of style, I think. Into the Magna Zone again, okay. Um, we need to take that Magna Zone out ASAP. So I'm just gonna go for the Dragon Tail onto it. Because I mean the Hydreigon's burned. So if I can just live this turn, get the Magna Zone out, um, you might want to switch. Just might, because um the Magna Zone's gonna hit hard. I don't know what Russo's last Pokemon is, I completely forgot. Um unless, actually, did he bring his Mega Pokemon to his Houndoom? I think it's Houndoom that he Russo uses right now. Okay, this is I'm going okay for me, not really too good for a Russo. <laughs> Into the floor, just that is a perfect shout right there. Eruption, trying to hit me too hard because also I'm a dragon, I resist it. Thunder Wave is going to be onto me. Okay, can I get the um, Dragon Tail off? I can. That is actually really, really good because obviously the Hydreigon is most likely going to go up on me, which is completely fine. Although it is a physical attacker, so I guess I'll rest this turn. Um, that should be completely fine. The Hyd if it's a physical Hydreigon, it's burned, so that's completely fine. So I guess I'll go for a rest just to get my status gone and to get full hit points. I mean, Jurantina's on like half hit points. I think I can tank a couple more hits, depending on what they use. If this is, I think the Hydreigon's are in Dark Pulse, unless that was a Crowbat that used it, then like, never mind. I have no idea what this guy is using at all. Um, gonna rest. Um, because I need that paralyzed gun, because if he keeps getting flinches on that, um... Because if he keeps getting like, the Zen Headbutt flinches on his, um, Flodgers, then that's really, really bad. He's gonna fly, okay, that's completely fine. Sacred Fire's gonna hit the Flodgers actually very, very hard. Moonblast, rip. No, this isn't gonna work at all. Okay then, so, I'm gonna rest, get my hit points back. Um, okay. The Flodgers is more like, most likely going to die this turn. Uh, you have Protect? Because if he has Protect, he might want to do it now. Um, might want to do that to get Leftover Recover it. So we can get Leftovers and he might be able to tank another hit. I guess I'll try to... I need to Toxic Solve the Enter. I guess I'll just... Dragon Tail, I'm going to be asleep for a couple of turns. I don't really want to swap out the Drentina. I don't see how much the Drentina can actually do against this specific in 2v2s, I don't think it's that great to be honest, but we'll see. Fly onto me, that's fine. I'd like to expect him to go for the Flodgers, I guess never mind. Surprised it didn't outrage, but it could hit the Flodgers I believe, because I'm pretty sure it's like completely random. No, I think actually the first turn is where you want it to go, and then the other outrages are completely random. Not a 100% sure. Um, I guess I'll just try to take this thing down. Um... I'm gonna be asleep, um, so he, um, Russo might live another hit. I wasn't really paying attention to how much damage I actually took. He could swap out again into his uh, Lugia. Okay, he is gonna swap out into Lugia, so that might have been a good idea because Lugia is really, really tanky. Unfortunately, with the Hydra, gonna go to like a Dark Pulse, that's gonna really, really suck. Okay, that did a good amount. I'm gonna fly again, the burn is gonna kill him. Um, okay, let me think about this. The Lugia, what can that do? It has Ice Beam, so the Hydreigon's gonna... No, it's probably not gonna touch me at all. I'll try to... Dragon Tail? What does it have? What Russo has his Lugia and his... Okay, so I don't want to go into the... Into that yet. Yeah, I guess I'll... I need to Toxic Stall it. Um... I guess I'll try and get it out of here. Surf, that's fine, because they can't hit me too hard. Um, can't hit the Hydreigon because it's flying, obviously. That kind of sucks, but well. Um, Sacred Fire is going to hit the Lugia. It's going to take it down very low. Fly is not going to be onto the Lugia as well. I woke up. Going to get rid of the Enter. Get rid of here. Back into the Drachi. 
Which is gonna suck if he keeps Zen Headbutt in spamming, but we should be fine. Lugia is uh, outspeeding everything somehow. The Hydreigon's gonna go down. So now it looks like it's gonna be like a 1v2 clutch, which shouldn't be too difficult. At least I'm hoping it isn't too difficult, because that's gonna hit very hard. Um, he doesn't have anything left on this, so I guess I'll Willow Wisp it just for the damage. Um, Actually, no, I should Willow Whisper Dratchy so he can't do a lot of damage, but I'm gonna go for Magnet Zone first. If we take out this like, guy first, we should be good. Um, I don't know what Rooster's EV trained in. Um, I think we should take out the Magnet Zone first. Because uh, one, once this guy's gone, and I think he hasn't got any Pokemon left, Willow Wisp onto the Magnet Zone, it missed! That does suck. Thunder Wave onto... Oh, onto Lugia. That is perfect right there. Okay, then. Um, so I just keep Dragon Tail in the Drachia to try and take out the other things. Because the, the Entei isn't doing too much, right? Actually, no, I'll save the Entei for later. I'll try and Willow Wisp the Drachia. Drachia? This guy only has one Pokemon left, so I definitely need to Willow Wisp him, right? I guess I'll Willow Wisp him. Okay, fly onto the Magnet Zone. Ooh, that's not going to do a lot. Zen Headbutt is going to be on to me this time. Okay, Willow Wisp. Okay, it's finally going to hit the uh, Magnet Zone. I can stall out both of these, which is completely fine. Thunder Wave. Oh, he misses. <laughs> Clutch. <laughs> okay, that's actually perfect. Um, let's go for the Willow Wisp onto the Drachi as well. He might. You also might. You might. Might just want. Just want to fly to not get hit. Because if he just doesn't get hit, then we can just stall him out with the with the wisps. Um, and I think that's kind of a good idea. Because I mean, they both are steel type, so it's got surf, which isn't really going to hit any of them really diff really hard, except for like the Drachia, I guess. Um, but if they fly, they're both resisted. But the ice beam also resists, and I'm pretty sure he has roost. What's your last move? So, Ice Beam, Fly, and... So I think he's got Fly because he's just been using it in, um, in, the, in Adventure Mode. So I got Paralyzed, that's fine. I can just rest that off if I need to, but I don't really need to because Junji is meant to be slow. <laughs> he has Rock Smash. Uh, that actually might be good against the Magda Zone. Although, he's not really going to hit it too hard. <laughs> oh, okay, then. Um... I guess I should just try and take down the Magnezone. The Dratchy has Zen Headbutt, which I have something, so I try and take it down. Kaelin, Zen Headbutt is going to be onto the Lugia, tanks it like a boss, and the Discharge is going to hit everything on the field, which is actually good for us, so I'll take it. The Dratchy can't hit very hard though because of the Zen Headbutt, so we might as well not go for that. We can use it to our advantage and just go for the Magnezone, and then we'll be in an advantage right here. So we um, protect. Protect the first turn, I believe. He is gonna flash cannon. Most likely. He's most likely gonna flash cannon because the Magazone does get that now. So let's try and, try and take down the Magazone so Rooster so can live. Because I'm pretty sure the Magazone should us be the Flogist. I don't I haven't used the Flogist personally. I know it's got really really it's got good tanking capabilities, but from a super effective hit from a Magnezone that's getting stabbed. I don't think it's going to live, um, just hopefully it just doesn't have it, that'd be nice, I am paralyzed so I'm going to go last in the turn and forge play going to swift, that's fine, protected, it doesn't affect me really good, flash cannon, predicted the flash cannon, if I can take down the mag zone right now, no rip, <laughs> I got, okay that did not work at all, oh the freaking paralyzed, no, okay well, we need to hit the mag zone, uh, you have shadow ball, I don't know what Flo just has, I think it's like Carmine, Wish, Protect, maybe Wish? If he can live a hit, then that'll be great. All he needs to do is live one hit, and then Protect. Swift is going to be onto both of us, it doesn't affect me, he's going to Wish. If he lives, that'll be good, I'm hoping, Riv, we can't have done anything there. Okay then, well, we, we can pull this off, okay? I still have three Pokemon left. This guy's gonna go down from a burn this turn, I believe. The Dragi can't hit me too hard. I am paralyzed, so that kind of sucks as well. Um, we should be able to win this, though. We should be able to pull through. 
Maybe we're going to the Manetric, but I don't. I think we should save that. Let's try and go for. Should I go for the rest and let the Drachi KO itself? That's probably a very bad idea, to be honest. I feel like we should probably swap out the Intimidate as well. Yeah, I guess we'll swap out into the into this. I think I can win this. Okay, let's go into the um, Manetric Swift. He's gonna Swift again. He knows he can't even touch me with that, right? I guess it predicted the swap out. Go into the into the Manetric Low. Let's go for the. Um, he, what does it have? Drachi? He has a Enter, and he has something else. So I guess I'll just flamethrower it, just to KO it. Okay, gonna withdraw the, oh, into the Enter, Blast Toy, so okay, I can Thunderbolt onto that. Then again, if you need to Thunderbolt, I can just, I mean, Vault Switch, I can just Thunderbolt it, which should almost one hit KO it. It's most likely gonna be a Mega Low, so that is going to suck, but that is fine. I went for the Flamethrower, so I guess I predicted that. He's most likely gonna swap back out again, but I don't know why he would do that. If I get a burn, that would be really nice. Please? I don't think we're gonna get it. Oh my gosh, we actually got it. <laughs> okay, let's go for... Actually, I guess we will Drag Ball Switch. I don't want to get damage onto anything else. I, I guess I will vault, uh, just spawn the ball. Blastoise can't have speed me unless it has Aqua Jet, which if it does have Aqua Jet, it's burnt anyway, so... And it's it's a special attacker. It's like we're gonna have like Dragon Pulse, Hydro Pump, stuff like that. Thunderbolt shouldn't be able to one hit KO, I believe. Never mind, it does. Okay, okay. <laughs> I, you can tell I haven't really used Manetric as well a lot. Going to go into the end here, though. I'm just gonna go for the Vault Switch, then I guess into the uh, appropriate Pokemon. Let's go for the Vault Switch. If this somehow KOs it as well, my gosh, it got a critical hurt. <laughs> Okay, then I guess I'll take that. Let's go into the Wishy Washer. <laughs> okay, Wishy Washer. Let's try, let's try and end this, okay? Let's get this. I'm not sure if Russo has seen the Wishy Washer yet, but hey, we, we can show it off, okay? Get Drachi. I know it's gonna most likely outspeed me. Um, I guess I'll just Z power that height, that scowled. Let's get this win, okay? Oh, he's gonna rest. Ooh, I guess I could just Earthquake it. Oh, I mean, rest on the Drachi. It's gonna be asleep for three turns. Which is completely fine. Let me get this Z move off really quickly. So I guess I com I completely forgot about Z moves being in the game and I have to use them in this battle. But hey, I I'm glad I actually got one of my freaking team. Okay, Hydro Pump or Hydro Vortex should do like over half, I believe, because of my insane damage output. Plus, I'm EV Train Special Attack. I'm pretty sure this is a special attack, right? Oh my gosh, it almost one hit KOs it. <laughs> okay, then let's uh, go into the U turn. Just because I think it's gonna one hit KO it if it doesn't. Into the Drunteeners, Dragon Tail it. And there we go. So that is gonna be the GG. Give him the GG. So there it is. So hopefully you guys enjoyed. I think we are gonna leave it off there. Um, we gonna leave it off there for the Jura. So then I might as well go get my. Uh, Rayquaza or Rayquaza for the next battle, so let's, let's see if he wants to uh, leave off there for the Drentino and then go for the Rayquaza one, so yeah, but anyway, um, I think we're most likely going to leave it off there, um, so I guess I'll end it off there, so hopefully you guys enjoyed, if you did, make sure to comment to see more Pokemon Brick and Bronze the games on Roblox, and like I mentioned at the beginning, I hope I remembered that uh, Russo's channel link will be down in the description below, so make sure to check him out, and like always, I'll see you guys next time.